Well, alright, hello, you today, my name is Vodboy5699, and welcome to this. Now, I originally recorded an unboxing video of this, and the quality of the video was really shit, because I had my camera down like that, and the qual and the microphone on the computer on the laptop was did not get it. So I was very quiet. I was talking like this and stuff. I was talking like that, and then we talked like that. So, so, so today, basically for this, I'm gonna give an overview of the physical copy of the PS4 of Doki Doki Literature Club last. Now, as you guys know, Doki Doki Literature Club has become one of my favorite games of all time to play. I absolutely love everything about it. So I'm probably just gonna kind of give this an overview and show what's inside of it. There are some really really cool things about this game, and I'll definitely will do it. I also ordered the, I also pre-ordered the Nintendo Switch, ver uh, the physical copy of the Nintendo Switch version as well, and I, um, I pre-ordered it on the first when I got paid, and I said it was supposed to be here today from FedEx, but it, it just said it was in Texas like at seven at seven thirty this morning, so I don't know if I'm gonna get it at the end of the day or it's gonna come in here when I'm at work tomorrow because I gotta be at work like at nine o'clock tomorrow morning. But so I wanted to get this done, so I definitely will get a, an unboxing video of the Nintendo Switch version as well. So, and I won't, and I won't talk like that. So, anyway, so basically, where I'm going to give it basically an overview or a review of the physical copy of the PS4 version of the Doki Doki Literature Club Plus. So, basically, on the cover, you got the lovely Monica on there, and she's holding the Doki Doki Literature Club Plus logo up there. As you can tell, the game is rated M for mature. It says rated M for violence, plus suggested things and strong language. This was made from by Team Sabato and a company, and a company called Synergy Forge. Uh, the digital release was supposed to come out, came out on June 30th this year. The physical copy was going to come, supposed to be released on the same day as well, and it got pushed back to August 31st, it got pushed back to September 21st, and it got pushed back to October 8th, and so luckily there was a no more, no more, um, no more delays. Today's, as I'm recording this and get this uploaded, it's October 8th, so it came out today. And so, I got the Doki Doki there as well. And funny story, because I wanted to go to, Wa I went to Walmart today to make sure to see if they got it. And Walmart didn't have any copies out. They didn't have any for the PS4. I didn't see any for the Nintendo Switch. So I said, I didn't even see any for the PS5. So I said, okay, I'm going to go. Luckily, there was a GameStop right next door. So I said, okay, I'm going to go over to the GameStop. So I ran over to the GameStop. And they're like, can I help you find some? Like, yes, do you guys have any copies of Doki Doki Literature Club Plus? Fuck, Doki 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 Literature Club plus and they said for P they said yes for system and it came out with PlayStation 4. So it was 30 bucks. I'm finally glad I have the physical copy of Doki Doki Literature Club Plus. And on the back you um, got the spine as well. Set upside down. No it has the spine as well. And then you got the back with all girls on there. You got Sayori, Yuri, Monica, and Natsuki. And, and many of you many of you guys know Natsuki is my is best girl in my opinion. So I don't know why, but I absolutely love Natsuki. She's the best girl in my opinion. And on the and on there it says, uh, enter the number one psychological horror experience. It pack pack include with new content, six new side stories, thirteen additional music tracks, a hundred lockable images and goodies inside of the box, and that's where we're gonna get you right now. So this is what you get when you get inside when you open it up. You got the you got the disc with Monica out there as well. Let me get it up. So oh no, there's mine. So let me get that out. I'll show those last. And I'm really cool with the goodies and all that as well. So you got the physical cut. You got the disc of Doki Doki Literature Club plus with Monica on there. It's a really beautiful disc. Really really cool. So shut that on there. And what we have here is, is some goodies. And this is good. this is the really best part about this. So here. We got the business card of Metaverse, and from the phone number, it is not it is out of country, so I don't know what it's from. So and then we got the um, one. This is really some cool thing because we got the uh, we got our own membership card to the Literature Club. You can put your name on there and your favorite color, favorite genre, and favorite world. So I would put my name on there. My favorite color is green. My favorite genre genre is horror. Horror, and my favorite favorite word. I have no idea what my favorite word is, but it has a membership card, and the date is October 8, 2021. That's really cool. It came with that as well. That's very neat. And then also, we got a digital code soundtrack download for the for a digital code for the Doki Doki Electric Plus, Plus soundtrack, and one of those uh, floppy disks you see on the Commodore 64, so that's really cool as well. And then also, what's really cool about this, you get your own poem. I, it doesn't say who made it. Who wrote this? But the poem is called Control. I don't know if it's gonna be the same poem in each uh, case or each or in each on each console or each case. But mine is called Control, and I don't know if Monica wrote this or Yuri wrote this. From the looks of it, it looks like maybe Siori and Monica wrote it. I have no idea. But you get your own poem. And that's very very cool. And then also you get some stickers as well. 
you got some stickers you got them when they're jumping in like poor Monica. I understand that's a part of the game, but I wish she had her own happy ending. Also, a good thing, there's a mod out there called Monica at the Story. Basically, in that mod, you bring Monica back and you spend time with her and she actually gets a happy ending and they update it all the time. So there's always new stuff to go with it. So, so you got stickers of them jumping and all that. So, very, very... Very cool. So that got left my train of thought. And then lastly, I don't know what these are called, but you got some cool things where um, you got Natsuki, Monica, Yuri, and Sayori. So if you want my opinion on my fa favorite the least, I don't hate any of the characters, but if I had to choose which how the, my order would from order would go, firstly, Natsuki would be number one, Sayori would be number two, Monica would be number three, and Yuri would be last at the bottom of the tier. And like I said, I don't hate any of the characters. I love them all. But if I had to, if I had to make an order, it would be Natsuki number one, Sayori number two, Monica number three, and Yuri number four. So very cool about that. And that's pretty much all the goodies and all that in there. So that is really cool. I'm so glad I finally got this. And I got it on the same day as well. And it's really cool, really cool. I finally got this, and I think it's good. The same stuff is gonna be in the Nintendo Switch version as well. I definitely would do an unboxing video. Instead, I'm supposed to get it today, <coughs> today, today as well. So I don't know if I'm gonna get it today or I'm gonna get it because I gotta be working nine tomorrow morning. So I have no idea if I'm gonna get this. It's gonna come in that FedEx today, arriving today. So maybe I'll get it. if I do get it today, one way or another. I will get it. I will post an unboxing video on that as well. So, anyway, so that is the physical form of Doki Doki Electric Club Plus. Thank you guys a lot for watching. If you want to get get a copy yourself of an, on a physical form of PS4, or PlayStation 5, or Nintendo Switch, I'll put the link down below. As always, thank you guys a lot for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure you hit a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, check my social media down below. As always, thank you guys a lot for watching. I'll see you all in the future video. Take it easy.